Hey folks, I was just out using this chainsaw, so it's still pretty hot, and you can see the, the chain's gotten pretty sloppy. And pretty easy, very easy actually, adjustment here. Uh, 13 millimeter socket, and you're gonna loosen these bolts here, both of these bolts, and as soon as that thing falls, as soon as the ball fall, the bar falls, you know it's loose enough. Again, it's kind of warm, so I might even need my gloves there. That's kind of hot. That bar is hot. So you're just gonna you're just gonna lift up on the bar, and you can see the chains there. Flathead screwdriver on here. You're just gonna turn this enough until the chain just snugs up a little bit against it. You don't want it tight. You just want it to get up there, and then you check it by just pull it and see if it goes smoothly. That's a little jerky, so I'm going to back it off a tiny bit. And you want to check that while it's while you're holding it up, even though it's hot. It still feels a little, little loose now, so you just find that sweet spot, just, to, just enough to snug it up and have it still move freely. just don't like the way look, that looks. I think that's going to call that good. Yep, still, still moves smoothly and it's up against it. And now it's just the opposite of the installation. Take your 13 millimeter, start with the back bolt and snug those up by hand. And you're not making these super tight, you're just making them kind of tight. That one's tight. There, good enough. Now our chain is about where we want it, still goes smoothly. It's all, they're all there is to it.